Hey, what's up everyone? Hippo TC here and welcome back to another quick tips video. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to stay alive during a fight on a sloop, a brig, or a galleon. What can you do to up your odds, up the chances of survival and being an effective border or defending your ship? If you like this video, go ahead and hit that like button, comment down below, and hell, subscribe while you're at it would mean a lot to me. Now, with that being said, let's jump into the video. Surviving a fight in Sea of Thieves is all about one thing, movement. Being able to move around on any ship without getting bogged down or trapped in a position where you can't get away or locked down or whatever the case might be is key to survival. And I'm kind of showing you right now some things that I like to do. I'll show you some practical things for each of the ships. But in general, one of the things that you want to be able to do is get used to moving around on any ship type. Jumping on the rails, jumping over the cannons, even on the sloop, there's a way to jump on the right side out of the railing and get up to the capstan things like that is going to save your life now practically speaking on the sloop there is a way to grab the ladder from underneath by the voyage table now i've done this quite a few times during combat and you kind of kind of see how you can do it you can go right to the window and grab the ladder from inside taking you outside of the ship it's a fantastic thing to do and i've used this quite a few times so on the sloop that is one of the big tips that i want you guys to know about for the brig it's very similar right like you need to be able to move around on a brig get comfortable jumping on the rails jumping over the cannons getting around using the masts to kind of protect yourself from shots near the helm that type of thing is going to get you um it's going to help you survive now one thing i like to do on the brig specifically is if you do decide to run down below don't go over here that that will get you pinned and will get you killed because there's no way to get around it. But if you do need a run down, I tend to run around right here, keeping the, the brig between me and my enemy. And it allows me a couple options to run back up top. I'm also right next to the food barrel, which is nice. So if I need some food, I can grab the food barrel right there. But yes, on a brig, if you do decide to run down, do not run to the right by the voyage where you vote for your voyages because that will just get you killed. Don't run by the bed, run near the brig, keep that brig uh, between you and the enemy and it, you should be able to just loop around. And I'm gonna show you some practical clips of me actually doing this in some fights here in a second. Um, but even at the end, like I like to be at the front of the brig. That way, if you do get knocked off, you can even just jump on the ship just like this. Now the Galleon is the biggest ship and allows you a lot of options. And I'm gonna show you probably one of the most practical options here in a second. And I use it all of the time. Normally speaking, when I board, I drop the anchor and I will run this way, jump down onto the balcony here, loop around and use this little ledge to jump back near the front. Now, this is a maneuver I use all of the time. It keeps you nimble. And most people think when you jump down in the balcony, they think you jumped right off the ship or they try to follow you and they'll fall down into the water or something like that. Another thing that you need to be careful with being able to survive on ships is choke points. So on the galleon, I don't really like to run all the way down as there's only one way up. But if you do decide to run below deck, I like to loop this way, which gives me a quick way to go right back up, kind of throwing the enemy off of their game. And again, giving me the ability to run back up around the loop and just jump right onto the deck of the ship. Like I said, maneuverability and movement on a ship and getting comfortable moving around quickly without having to think is key. This will help you survive any ship, any fight, any encounter. Now let's show you some clips of me actually doing this live on stream. And I'm gonna just kind of talk through what we're seeing and what's kind of going on here. So this first fight is a galleon. It's me versus a whole crew. I'm gonna board here. I just shot this guy and killed him. They're trying to revive and I don't wanna get pinned down. So I'm staying nimble. I'm running into a guy. I jump down here onto the balcony. I'm doing that loop that I just showed you. I run across, I hear them reviving. I shoot this guy, sort him a little bit, but I don't stick around. I don't stick around. I wanna survive. So I'm doing everything that we just talked about. Jumping on the rails, moving around, using the mask to protect, and then I'm kind of lining up right there for a lunge and able to pull off a lunge. This next clip is me on a brig, 
and I love lunges, especially against big crews. It kind of pushes everybody back and around, but right here, I need a second to eat some food. So I'm running down around the brig, jumping through the guys as they try to block me and just trying to stay alive. And what I love about the brig too, is I didn't talk about this earlier, but if you need a second, you can jump off into the water. And in particular, this clip was able to kill him. And I did manage to steal a chest of legends, which is what I was after at the end of the day. And there you go. The number one thing I think we all can do to get better at PVP is maneuverability on a ship and knowing some movements that will keep you alive. All of these things that I've talked about, all these techniques and things I've shared in this video have helped me survive fights I shouldn't have and helped me come out on top. And I hope they help you make sure to share this with a friend or a crewmate that you think this will help. And like I said, thanks again for watching and I hope to see you out on the seas. Thank you.